in this lecture we will learn about constants in c++ okay so constants so we will learn here about how we represent constants so we write a very simple c++ code that given number of dozens of apple you find how many apples are there in it okay so this is very simple mathematics if you are given let's say five dozen of apples you will just multiply 5 into 12 and you will get total number of apples so which is 60 apples here so this is the code so we write in total apples which represents this variable represents total number of apples it is initialized to 0 and number of dozens so it is 0 now so now what we do we ask the user to enter the number of dozens of apple for which he want the number of apples he takes the user input number dozens total apple is number of dozens into 12 and then we print that okay total number of apples is total apples okay so this code is fine okay and if you run this so it builds fine and even it runs fine so enter the number of dozens of apple 5 total number of apples is 60 okay so this runs well but the thing is this code doesn't look very good because this 12 is a literal okay a constant but it's a literal we write the number directly if you want your code to be readable well readable and which can be understood easily so we would like to replace this with a symbolic constant so one way to write this symbolic constant is using a preprocessor that is hash defined and we write number in a dozen is 12 so what we do here we copy this and we write that number of dozens into this number in a dozen okay so when your code is being compiled this number in dozen will be replaced by 12 but it looks much clearer now so we try to build this code okay it gets built again you can run this code it will run the same way let's say three dozen so is 36 and it runs fine but macros have problems in themselves that's why it is now not being very much encouraged to be used in c++ okay so what we do so c++ provides you with a const object okay so what happens is unsigned short int so okay so we will write here in fact const unsigned short int number in dozen const okay it means now when you define this so when it is initialized to 12 so in the runtime your value of this number in dozen const cannot be changed so that's the impost importance of const when it is initialized it cannot be changed in runtime so it will have that value itself unless you recompile it again so this will also become a constant value and you can use this one so this will be much better accepted okay so number in dozen const so we can replace here with this value and let's see so we will run this code here build it and you run it so again it will be the same code enter number of apples two dozens to 24 apples are there but the main benefit of this code is that here what happens is with this const now this number will never change and let's say you were using this formula the number in dozen const lot of place at lot of places so if this somehow let's say a new thing came okay number of apples in a dozen changed to be six so you had to change the code at so many places wherever you were using 12 as the literal so now you just replace it here and everywhere it will be changed okay so this is the benefit of const okay and that's why we use const okay so i hope you understand this thanks a lot